In opposition, Margaret Thatcher campaigned for the UK to remain in the European community, the precursor to the EU. But once in office, the Iron Lady tussled with Europe, winning the infamous UK rebate in 1984, as one MEP recalls. She saw that Europe was heading in the wrong direction, it was costing too much, it was costing the British too much, uh, and it was out of tune with the sentiment of the British people. Like most sensible British people, she was Eurosceptic. Thatcher also backed the creation of a European single market, but she would later claim to have been fooled over how it would deepen integration. She regretted, I think, signing the Single European Act, um, which was the instrument which, of course, launched the uh, single market. So that was good, and she approved of that. I think what she didn't fully understand at that time, and she did subsequently, was that it also launched European political cooperation and took us deeper into this more integrated uh, political entity. That's the thing that she objected to. Yet Europe would be her downfall. The then divided Conservative Party decided to oust her as leader in November 1990. I believe we've had some success.